New York Rangers jokes, NHL jokes. Q, what do the New York Rangers and the Titanic have in common? A, they both look good until they hit the ice. Q, what's the difference between frequent flyer miles and the New York Rangers? A, frequent flyer miles earn points. Q, why do Rangers fans drink from a saucer? A, because the cup's always in Detroit. Q, why did the Rangers enforcer retire early? A, he was ice fishing and got run over by the Zamboni. Q, why don't the Rangers drink tea? A, because the Canadiens and Red Wings have all the cups. Q, what do you call five New York Rangers players standing ear to ear? A, a wind tunnel. Q, why are the Rangers like grizzly bears? A, every fall they go into hibernation. Q, what does a recent high school dropout and the New York Rangers have? In common. A, they're both young, have no goals and no good prospects. Q, what's the difference between a line of cocaine and a pair of Rangers? Tickets. A, people would pass up a pair of Rangers tickets. Q, what's the difference between the Detroit Red Wings and the New York? Rangers. A. The last Red Wings Stanley Cup team picture isn't in black and white. Q. What's the difference between a fat chick and the Rangers? A. Even a fat chick scores every once in a while. Q. Why do the Rangers suck at geometry? A. Because they never have any points. Q. What is it called when a New York Rangers player blows in another? Rangers player's ear. A. Data transfer. Q. What do college students and the Rangers have in common? A. They've both finished their year by April. Q. What's blue and orange and goes down the toilet faster than liquid? Plumber. A. The New York Rangers. Q. What do a fine wine and the New York Rangers have in common? A. They both spend a lot of time in the cellar, cost too much and are only enjoyed on select occasions. Q. Why did the post office recall their latest stamps? A. They had pictures of Rangers players on them and people couldn't figure out which side to spit on. Q. Why do people like driving a car with a Rangers fan? A. Because you can park in the handicap zone. Q. What do you get when you combine all 23 New York Rangers with 23 lesbians? A. 46 people that don't do dick. Q. What is the difference between a New York Rangers fan and a pothole? A. I would swerve to avoid the pothole. Q. What song do New York Rangers fans sing before the end of the third? Period. A. Nobody knows. There's never any of them left. Q. What's the difference between the New York Rangers and a mosquito? A. A mosquito stops sucking. Q. What do the New York Rangers and possums have in common? A. Both play dead at home and get killed on the road. Q. What is the difference between a Rangers fan and a baby? A. The baby will stop whining after a while. Q. Did you hear the New York Rangers are moving to the Philippines? A. They are going to be called the Mania Folders. Q. What do I have in common with the New York Rangers? A. Next week. We'll both be watching the Stanley Cup Finals on television. Q. What do New York Rangers fans and sperm have in common? A. One in three million has a chance of becoming a human being. Q. How many New York Rangers does it take to change a tire? A. One, unless it's a blowout, in which case they all show up. Q. What do you call 23 millionaires around a TV watching the Stanley Cup? Finals. A. The New York Rangers. Q. How can you tell if a Rangers fan just sent you a fax? A. There's a stamp on it. Q. What do the New York Rangers and Billy Graham have in common? A. They both can make 15,000 people stand up and yell Jesus Christ. Q. What is the difference between a bucket of shit and a New York Rangers fan? A. The bucket. Q. If you have a car containing a Rangers forward, 
a ranger's center, and a ranger's defender, who is driving the car. A. The cop. Q. How do you castrate a New York Rangers fan? A. Kick his sister in the mouth. Q. What should you do if you find three New York Rangers hockey fans? Buried up to their neck in cement. A. Get more cement. Q. What's the difference between a New York Rangers fan and a carp? A. One is a bottom feeding, scum sucker, and the other is a fish. Q. How did the New York Rangers fan die from drinking milk? A. The cow fell on him. Q. What does a New York Rangers fan do when his team has won the Stanley Cup? A. He turns off the PlayStation 3. Q. How many New York Rangers fans does it take to change a light bulb? A. None. Lava lamps don't burn out man. Q. What does a New York Rangers fan and a bottle of beer have in common? A. They're both empty from the neck up. Q. Why do New York Rangers fans keep their season tickets on their dashboards? A. So they can park in handicap spaces. Q. How do the Rangers spend the first week of training camp? A. Studying the Miranda rights. Q. How do you keep a Rangers fan from masturbating? A. You paint his dick flyers orange and black and he won't beat it for four years. Q. Why do ducks fly over Madison Square Garden upside down? A. There's nothing worth creping on. Q. Why doesn't Albany have a professional hockey team? A. Because then New York City would want one. Q. Did you hear that New York's hockey team doesn't have a website? A. They can't string three W's together. Q. What's the difference between a Madison Square Garden hot dog, and a Wells Fargo Center hot dog? A. You can buy a Wells Fargo Center hot dog in May. Q. Why did BP hire the New York Rangers to clean up the Gulf oil spill? A. Because they'll go out there and throw in the towel. Q. What's the difference between a dead dog in the road and a dead new York Rangers fan in the road? A. There are skid marks in front of the dog. Q. What is a New York Rangers fan's favorite wine? A. We can't beat Philadelphia. Q. How do you stop a New York Rangers fan from beating his wife? A. Dress her in Philadelphia orange and black. Q. What's the difference between the Madison Square Garden and a red light district? A. In a red light district, you pay $300 bucks and somebody scores. Q. What's the difference between the New York Knicks and the New York Rangers? A. The Knicks shoot at a net. Q. Why are the New York Rangers like the United States Postal Service? A. They both wear uniforms and don't deliver. Reckless driver. A Rangers fan liked to amuse himself by scaring every Flyers fan he saw. Strutting down the street in an obnoxious hockey jersey. He would swerve. His van as if to hit them, then swerve back just missing them. One day while driving along, he saw a priest. He thought he would do a good deed, so he pulled over and asked the priest, Where are you going? Father. I'm going to give Mass at Street. Francis Church, about two miles down the road, replied the priest. Climb in, Father. I'll give you a lift. The priest climbed into the passenger seat, and they continued down the road. Suddenly, the driver saw a Flyers fan walking down the road, and he instinctively swerved as if to hit him. But, as usual, he swerved back onto the road just in time. Even though he was certain that he had missed the guy, he still heard a loud thud. Not knowing where the noise came from, he glanced in his mirrors but still didn't see anything. He then remembered the priest, and he turned to the priest and said, Sorry father, I almost hit that Flyers fan. That's okay, replied the priest I got him with the door. Better at sex. There were two men, one was a Rangers fan and the other was a Flyers fan. 
These men were both madly in love with the same woman. So the woman challenged that whichever man does a better job at having sex with her would be her boyfriend. Both men accepted the challenge. That night, the woman had sex with the Rangers fan and then the other night had sex with the Flyers fan. The next day the woman chose the Flyers fan to be her boyfriend. Shocked and outraged, the Rangers fan asked why she didn't choose him. She replied by saying, You, like your team not only come up short but always finish early. Career Day It's career day in elementary school where each student talks about what their dad does. Little Johnny is last, and finally the teacher calls on him to talk about his dad. Johnny comes to the front of the class. My daddy is a dancer at a gay bar. He takes off his clothes for other men, and if they pay him enough money, he goes into the alley and performs sex acts on them. The teacher is shocked, and she calls for an early recess for the rest of the class. She sits down with Johnny and asks him if this is really true about his dad. Johnny says, no, but I was too embarrassed to say he played for the new York Rangers. First grade. A first grade teacher explains to her class that she is a New York Rangers fan. She asks her students to raise their hands if they were Rangers fans, too. Not really knowing what a Rangers fan was but wanting to be like their teacher, hands explode into the air. There is, however, one exception. A girl named Mary has not gone along with the crowd. The teacher asks her why she has decided to be different. Because I'm not a Rangers fan. Then, asks the teacher, what are you? Why I'm proud to be a Philadelphia Flyers fan, boasts the little girl. The teacher is a little perturbed now, her face slightly red. She asks Mary why she is a Flyers fan. Well, my dad and mom are Flyers fans, and I'm a Flyers fan, too. The teacher is now angry. That's no reason, she says loudly. What if your mom was a moron, and your dad was a moron, what would you be then? A pause, and a smile. Then says Mary, I'd be a Rangers fan. Skunk. A skunk walks into a bar and sees three guys in the corner wearing Rangers. Jerseys. He turns to the bartender and says yeah lll think I stink.